What's up everybody? So currently WhatsApp only allows you to open one WhatsApp number on WhatsApp web at a time. You can open two different WhatsApp numbers, only one. But this is because you're only using one browser. So if you try to open the same WhatsApp number on different tabs in the same uh, browser, WhatsApp is going to say use here or use there. You're going to have to choose one browser to use it on or the other, but you can't have it on both browsers. So if I was to link this number, for example, uh, I'm going to go to WhatsApp web. Uh, this one already has link. So if I go to WhatsApp web and I go to link device and I scan that QR code, and I'm now logged in here. I try to open WhatsApp on the same one. It's going to tell me that I, it's going to use it here and it's not going to let me use it on both sides. I can only choose it on one tab. So if you have two different numbers, like even if it's not the same number, it's always going to be automatically logged into this number and it won't allow you to link to a different device just because you're in a different tab. So a way to get around this is to have, like you can see here, I'm in incognito mode. I also have a WhatsApp number linked on my PC already uh, and it's in normal mode. So if I'm in normal mode, this is going to be a different phone number. So this is a different phone number. This is one phone number that is linked to my WhatsApp web. And then I have incognito mode linked onto a different number. So this is like for work, for example, and this one is for personal use at home. And you can see here that I have two different numbers linked. Um, the messages are also different in that way. And if you need more than just two because one or because two numbers is not enough for you, you can also use the WhatsApp web, install it and you can also link a different number by using a different QR code again. You see, this allows you to scan the QR code and link a different number. Once again, you can take another phone with a phone number, another WhatsApp and install that onto this. And if this is not enough, you can even install, you can use Microsoft Edge and do it on Microsoft Edge. And um, you can also log in as well, but that's going to be a nightmare for you to administer because you're not going to remember which one is which. Right now, I'm able to tell the difference because I put my personal one on light mode and the work one on dark mode so I can tell which WhatsApp I'm, uh, I'm working on. So I don't send the wrong people the wrong messages because I've done a lot of that. Yes, I have. So that's pretty much it. That's how you use multiple WhatsApp numbers on one laptop. All right. I hope this helped and uh, you found some use for it. Till next time, peace.